Hey, this is Mike with CalSierra, and today I'm gonna to show you how to properly calibrate your printer for RFID labels. First, what we wanna do is make sure that your printer is capable of printing or encoding RFID labels. So first of all, if you have a Zebra printer, uh, ZT400 uh, series or 600 series, make sure that you, know, you have an RFID uh, encoder already attached to it. If you do not see this label, uh, you can check the internal component. If you open the media cover right over here, open your print head. And if this piece right over here um, is uh, black instead of just the metal plate, then this is your RFID encoder and it's already plugged in in the back over here. Now, before calibrating a printer, what we're gonna do is ensure that your media is installed correctly. Um, with that set, what we'll do is we will place the media through the media guide over here. Your media tab should be flashed with the edge of the um, labels themselves. And also right on the bottom uh, of the media guide right over here is the media sensor that detects, you know, gap notch and also the marks. So depending on what labels you have, if you have a, you know, mark on the back or there's a gap notch, which I do have, uh, you're gonna position that media sensor accordingly. So mine has gap notches on either side. So mine tab of the media sensor will be positioned all the way to the left side of the printer. Then we're just gonna close off the print head and media is installed and now we're gonna turn on the printer. Once the printer turns on, uh, it will calibrate as a normal media, meaning that it will not detect the labels. It will just pretty much pretend that the RFID does not exist. So it will just calibrate as you normally would have regular labels uh, and not the RFID labels. So right now I got an error message because this printer paused and it tells me that the ribbon is out. So what we need to do is if you are using a uh, thermal transfer labels, which these are, you need to install uh, a ribbon. So I'm gonna be installing ribbon to uh, be compatible with these labels. To install a ribbon, I'm just gonna open the media cover, open the print head, and you can just follow the guiding lines of how the ribbon should be installed. So I have a ribbon right over here. It is a resin ribbon. It's gonna follow the arrows, go underneath the print head, onto the spooler. And then I'm just gonna turn it several times to make sure that the spooler grabs it and there's no creases on the ribbon itself. I'm gonna wind up the labels back up because I don't wanna lose any good labels. And now I'm just gonna close the cover and press the pause button and the printer should calibrate. Perfect. Okay, so what you're gonna do is you're gonna go to home and you're gonna go to the RFID tag. It says RFID okay. If you don't see RFID okay over here, it's gonna say no RFID tag found, you will just basically recalibrate the printer for the media. So you'll go to settings and you will start media calibration manually. Um, and then you're gonna follow the steps on the screen, calibrate it. And then once you're done over there, what you'll do is you'll come over here to media uh, RFID status, status okay, and you're gonna start the calibration. This process might take about, you know, two to three minutes, depending on the size of your label, what kind of antenna you use, and what kind of chips you use. Perfect, so now the calibration is complete. Your printer is ready to print on, and as you can see, it has different um, reads that it did to itself by reading the tags. And you are ready to go.